Hello everyone, welcome to join us. Now we're at a small village in Sanjiangdong, autonomous county in South China's Guangxi. Behind me, it is a museum of embroidery. Today, we're going to take you to look at, to look at how this traditional embroidery improved the local people's life and lifted them out of poverty, and how the local inheritors to hand this tradition down to the next generation. And today, we have invited one of the local inheritors, Yang Tian, to join us, and she will give us much more details about this tradition.我们洞绣的衣袋子绣就是纸都包在里面很有立体感一般我们是绣衣服给我们圈的这几年呢有外面的非常喜欢我们的四绣我们出去展啊就是拿去卖呀国外也到这里来啊经常到就是这个把这个四绣推出去我以前不知道现在我才知道祖传下来的东西不能忘更不能丢要传承下去要把它呃承产业推到国外 What an exquisite handicraft years of inheritance and development, Dong embroidery has been listed as a national intangible cultural heritage and has attracted thousands of local people to participate in this form of art. Today, it plays a key role in boosting the local economy, particularly after handmade fabrics are increasingly sold home and abroad. Through the ethnic tradition, Thousands of the local people have got rid of poverty. What's more, high-speed sp rail helps bring this unique art form of the Manok County to the rest of China. Just like the bullet train, we believe Dong embroidery will de develop faster and meet a brighter future.